good job. Who's sitting for me? Uh-uh-uh. Very good sitting, Riley. Who else is sitting? Who else is sitting? Cassie? Good girl. Good girl. Who else? Riggs? Roscoe, are you not jumping anymore? Raymond? Oh, very good boy. Hey, guys. What we thought we'd do this time with our eight-week video of the puppies is just kind of do a group video. Kind of let you see them hanging out, playing. Um, it often gets a little bit repetitive when we do the same kind of thing, saying, oh, this is this dog and this is that dog. I was going to talk a little bit about each one of their personalities. A very good job, Riggs. Riggs is our Mr. Focus, as you can see. Um, he actually, he did very, very well. If you saw one, his one video where he did the focus work outside, first time out, he was awesome. He was amazing. Um, doesn't keep an attention span very well, but I think it's just, it all goes with the age and so forth. Little Ray, as we call him Little Ray, because he was the last one to be born. He is a little cuddle guy. He is one of those puppies that just wants you to kind of like love on him, be on him, right? He, he comes up to you, he'll show you his laying, which he was just trying to show me right now that I just got him. I know, he gives puppy kisses. He used to be the littlest, but now Cassie's the littlest, right? Everybody's going through their little biting stage right now at eight weeks. Um, this here is Miss Riley. Miss Riley's entertaining herself with a leaf right now. She is a girl who's a little bit, a little bit less impatient. Um, she's a, I see you, Riggs. Riggs keeps falling because he knows that I have treats in my pockets. Uh, she knows her sit. She knows what she's supposed to do. She really, really does love to train. She's a very, very good girl, right? But she gets impatient because she wants it to happen now. Uh, when it's time for her food, it's just like, are you going to give it to me? Because we make them all sit before they end up having the food. I don't need my fingers eaten alive. Let's see who else is over here. Ooh, let's see. Miss Caitlin's over here. Miss Caitlin actually is a sweetheart. She is, and they all are, um, but she's a little girl that's just kind of, you know, she kind of hangs to herself. I'd say she's probably a little bit more of an observer. She kind of just goes around. She does like to snuggle as well. Um, she just kind of, she's there. She just wants hugs and kisses and, you know, everybody else will be playing and she's laying there being all real good, which could change because it's, you know, it's an eight-week maturity thing. Um, right? Are you a good girl? Let's see. Who else do we have to get? Um, I see Miss Cassie. Miss Cassie's laying under the bench over here. Cassie is a riot. She is probably one of the most independent girls we have. Um, she, come here out, Cassie. Come on out. Oh, boop, 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 boop. She is uh, fearless. This girl literally will take the two steps and just go right out. She doesn't even worry about going down the steps. It's just like, oh, okay. And that's one thing I've noticed with this group is a lot of one when we did our personality testing, a lot of them we found that were, sh that were timid, going to be timid to sound. And by us working with the whole tones, it changed it much quicker. So that was kind of a nice thing as well. Uh, there's Mr. Roscoe. Mr. Roscoe, is our, he's our fun guy. He's the one that just kind of looks for, hey, what can we do? And let's go get a ball and let's go do, he's, he's, a, he's a backyard boy's dog, I guess I would call him that. Um, I think that's what Christina called him earlier. He's just one of those where um, if he poops, he'll come running up to you like, hey, guess what I did? Just a typical boy, right? You find him probably the mud puddles, eating bugs. In fact, he was the one, was he the one playing with the cicada? I think he was playing with cicada earlier and just barking at it and thinking it was just a riot. So he's a typical, typical boy, right? Okay, so who else, let's see, who do we have? We did, oh, Calvin, where's our Calvin Klein? Mr. Calvin is all, no, let's see, I think that's Raymond, isn't it? No, it's Calvin. Calvin! Hi, Calvin! What are you doing? I think Calvin's got to go potty, so we're going to make this quick so he doesn't <laughs> pee or poop on me. Um, Calvin is probably the smartest lab that we'll have ever had here. He's doing things with, like me, with Christina, um, that it was taking other puppies much, much longer to even pick up. Uh, the problem with, not problem, but with, with that comes a highly distracted dog. So it's one of those where he's very, very smart. Just think of that, you know, child that goes to school in, in, uh, in the kindergarten and they're actually, you know, going at a third grade level. They get bored very quickly. So he's gonna need somebody to keep him challenged. Um, but he is a very, very sweet boy, right? He's also a pant leg biter for right now, right? You're a pant leg biter. I know, tell everybody hello, right? And your buddy Cosmos over here, you can say hi to Cosmos. Cosmos has to get all of his puppies and say hello to everybody. Everybody loves Cosmos. That, they get a little bit too much for him, so we have to kind of go through. So I think we've gotten everybody. We did Roscoe, Raymond, Riley, um, Calvin, Cassie, 
and Caitlin, and that's all seven of our pups. They're wonderful. Um, hey, is everybody coming back? Who's gonna sit? Oh, look at the laying from Miss Riley, and look at the sitting from Roscoe. And as you can see, Roscoe, look at that happy face. Good girl, Riley. And like I said, she loves the training. Just very, very patient with getting her treats, right? Good day. Who else can come here? <gasps> Who can go here? Cassie, here, please. Hurry. What's next, baby? <sighs> Very good girl. So we teach everybody to hear, and then they have to sit when they're supposed to. Our other bums are laying under there. I think our other ones are back playing underneath the tunnel. But thanks for watching, guys. And, uh... oh, here comes Riggs. Here, Riggs. What's next, buddy? Good boy. Sing, see, everybody can plop their butts on the ground. Oh, the queen bee. And like I said, this girl, look at no fear whatsoever. She's absolutely adorable. She's got a super smooth coat, so it means she's going to be an active girl. So Cassie and I want to say thanks for watching, guys. Right? Tell everybody thank you. Thanks, guys.